listen to this. Yeah, does this sound more like this 8-track tape? But this 8-track tape sounds pretty good if it has better quality and, and much better sound to this. So, anyways, it's a top-of-the-line top tape because it's a pretty good decent quality for a 70 type, decent quality or anything like that. But anyways, that is not the case whatsoever. So, this morning, I decided to, it's a good idea to make a, a new invention that I made as of right now. I started making my own creation of what I use it as an 8-track tape. But anyways, I found something completely different. And that is, this is the stuff that I invented right now as of today. And this is what I did. Yep, an 8-track adapter. I know a lot of you people on YouTube have seen, seen this video of uh, how to connect an 8-track to, to, tape to an iPod or whatever it is. Yes, it's an 8-track player. It's so cool, and you don't need to buy an 8-track tape at a Goodwill or Salvation Army or a flea market. Yep, it's, it's totally new. I made this tape. Uh, I made this machine, this this hack. This is one of my hack jobs that I did this morning. I did an excellent job doing... It's an easy hack because I just decided to do it. It's a good idea to make this because I use tweezers just to... Yeah, I just put it, pulled it right out of that piece of plastic right there. I took this all apart because I used this to take them apart. I, I used the, um, I put a new head in there because to, to, it, it would be great for an 8-track tape to play stuff like that. Yep, I started using this. And of course, there's the little spool right there. Yep, the spool or reels, whatever, it could be used as a kind of like a loop or something. And that's got it. That is not. That's that's the case that I, I decided to remove this and I removed some of the stuff. I took this right out of a cassette adapter. But this is the one I took and I made this as an eight and passed it as an eight track adapter. Yep, it could can it could hook up to an iPod, it could hook up to a, a cassette deck or whatever. And this is how this, this is supposed to work. It works on any other MP3 players. So Let's pop this in and find out. Yep, you can hear it. there's no music in there, but yeah, it doesn't. It do, the machine doesn't move. So um, I hook up to this one. I ended up hooking up to my 2003 iPod, which I used that for a very long time. It has this. This iPod is only 10 years old. So I got this. Actually, I made this. This is not today. I got it, but this is the one I made as um it's a it's a pretty good ipod it, it's this is it's it's a connection because it's a connector to connect the ipod into them into the the aux jack because i use this as a pretty nice one because i've tried this out and it looks pretty good but it's some couple of issues there there was a left channel it's kind of weak so i don't know how to adjust this thing or whatever it is so um i would like to just uh, to give you a little demonstration here for uh for other purpose, I decided to give you a little a go here for a moment because I'm going to play a couple of songs on my iPod and see what it does. Um, man, that's pretty interesting to say. Oh, you, uh, uh, buh, 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 buh. oh, yeah, but that's, um, let's see how it does. Yep, it works. See, the level meter is weak. And... Yes. Yeah, you can see the channel is kind of weak.
Oh yes, <laughs> it's playing right now. The one you're playing is Lady Gaga, Bad Romance. Wow, it's playing on a Panasonic 8-track recorder. I have not ever seen anything in my life. I made, this is a, a good hack job for making this 8-track adapter. Uh, enough of this. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna play the whole rest of the song. I'm not, I don't like Lady Gaga. Blah, blah, blah. And how about another song that I would recognize that? It's, uh, yeah. I, w I wish we were ready to play this one because, uh, eh, my Cyrus, ugh. I have, I have, how about a better idea? Oh. It's a children's marching song they're playing right now. How about the monkeys? Yeah, that's why you're talking about the monkeys. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. I know it's Gilbert O'Sullivan. I think this is pretty nice. How about this? Oh yeah, the left channel's kind of weak. Yep, found this. Actually, I made this invention. This is an 8-track adapter that I made myself this morning. And I know, tell us what you think, and I, I hope you'll all like this one, because leave a comment or whatever. Whatever it is, and tell us what you think about this. My hack job. This is a very interesting adapter, if you know. I know there are too many... Uh, you know, there was a lot of stuff on eBay to have the A-Track adapters, the cassette adapters that were on eBay. I don't know if I even know I managed to get it because I didn't have it because I, I started creating this one because I think it's a pretty good, interesting tape. This is an A-Track adapter to go with this. Hook up to the iPod, hook up to the stereo system, whatever. I know... Tell us what you think and uh, leave a comment or so. So hope you like it.